it won't happen overnight. That's another shocking revelation. I'm full of them. I've got lots more for you. This is a marathon, not a sprint. I can give you lots of sayings, and I'm going to. <coughs> Most people, if you're like me, are impatient. You're trying to grow your business. Someone comes along like John Butt on his marketingforowners.com site or his podcast and says, just do this, just do that, and that's all it takes. Well, I'll be honest, it's going to take longer. I've been working at this for years. Notice this on top, grey hair. I'm old. I've been working a long time and I've had that advantage of time to learn. I've made a lot of mistakes and I've got a lot of things right. I've stood on the shoulders of giants and learnt from them. It's, it's, a, it's just going to take time. Anything that is a quick fix is not going to happen. There is no magic pill. There's no silver bullet. Anything you read is going to tempt you into buying something that promises it's going to do wonders for you overnight. My systems will take time. The important thing to know is that once you set them up, you will look back and you think, you'll think, why did I not do that before? Why did I not start earlier? Once you start building your email list, you'll think, why didn't I do that before? But as long as you start, you're going to make progress. My favourite phrase, quote, whatever, I'm always a bit embarrassed to tell people because it sounds so ordinary, is slow and steady wins the race. And the reason is because in my experience, through everything I've tried, it's the things that are built up slowly and gradually that stick. Anything that works right now, that I could do today, starts working tomorrow, is going to not work sooner or later. The things I work on gradually, 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 they are going to stick. They're going to be built properly, thoroughly, systemized properly. They're going to work. This is the same whether it's in your marketing, your systemization, or in anything. So I just want you to realize that it will not happen overnight. However, to encourage yourself and to keep yourself going, you need to congratulate yourself every now and again. And today being Tuesday, time for a Tuesday toolbox tip, I'm going to recommend the tool that I use. And in fact, quite a few of my staff use as well. And so do a lot of others. It's called I Done This uh, at idonethis.com. It is free. They do have a paid version. And to be honest, we actually tried the paid version, but we went back to the free ones because uh, it's more of an individual thing. We weren't using it in that way. But the paid version only costs a few dollars. <coughs> I find it hard to explain I done this, about as hard to explain as <laughs> when Twitter first appeared. However, you sign up and it's a way of reminding yourself that you've done things. You sign up, you enter your email address <coughs> and you set a time and say at, uh, for me, I think it's 10 o'clock at night or something, it emails me with a message and it says, John, what did you do today? I enter in a list of my achievements what I did that's significant, hit reply, and it sends email back. Their online cloud system records that, and it saves it for posterity. It's for me. They don't show it to anyone. This is entirely private. But I can look back at any time, and I can find that I did stuff every day. Even if I take a day off to spend with my kids, that to me is an achievement. I record that too. Now, I reply seven days a week. You can actually go online and, and do it online. You can fill it in in all manner of ways. I do it my way. They'll have advice on how others do it. When someone first pointed this out to me, I was 
sort of sceptical. I didn't get it. I tried it. I have now been using it for, I don't know, a couple of years. And all the people I've told about it are still sticking with it. No one, when you're the boss, no one gives you a congratulatory pat on the back. So you've got to give it to yourself. You've got to realise you achieve things. Have you ever got home at the end of the day and, uh, and say your spouse has said, how's your day been? And you reply, you say, oh, I've been flat out busy. And then they say, what did you do? You think about it for a few seconds and you say, I don't know, but you know you were busy. You can't recall anything. This is a way of recording what you did. You need congratulations, even if you have to give it to yourself. <laughs> Go on, try idonethis.com. See if it works for you like it has for me.